Coming up next, it's a flyweight matchup between Joanne Calderwood and Valentina Shevchenko. takedowns if need be, but given this matchup on paper, we're expecting really a glorified kickboxing match here under mixed martial arts. Rules. They can head to the popcorn booth right now because we don't need them. This is going to be all striking. Leave that grapple button empty. Don't touch it. Cover it with a piece of tape. You don't need it. Striker versus striker. Oh! She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed, and it looks like she's going to finish this fight. She landed a huge knee to the head. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. How good a job does she do defensively to protect that head, raise the guard, a lot of good things in there. Yep, hands up, chin down. She's got a perfect position for defensive boxing. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Midway through round one. Straight to the body by Jojo Collins. Oh, that's a hell of a kick by her there. We'll see if she can follow it up now. That's a perfect scramble right there. Beautiful transition. So just over 20 total strikes. And now landed for Valentina Shevchenko. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Lunges forward with a left there. Just missed with the left there. Just over two minutes to go. Nice body. Well, she's been good tonight, but she missed without. Oh, the right hand is there for her. Beautiful body kick. Again, she chooses to clinch here. Liver kick. And she connects with a punch there, champ. She's so accurate. She's so good at timing all of her strikes. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Powerful leg kick land. Shevchenko gets crushed with that hook. Big shots being landed on both sides here. And they separate. Clinch. Oh, she's really starting to put together some significant body shots here, attacking both sides now. Final seconds of round one. Second round, straight ahead. So five minutes in the can, here we go now with okay, the start of our two. second round. Joanne Carter no, versus Valentina Shevchenko. Straight punch land. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Shevchenko's head kick attempt, that one is blocked. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Just a slip there. the takedown, no problem. 48 total strikes that have landed for Joanne Carter. Well, misses on 60% of the strikes, landing with just 40% accuracy against Valentina Shevchenko. Shevchenko gets in the clinch yet again. Oh, there she goes. She moves to her back. 
And a nice job to stick with it there to complete the takedown. Just over three minutes to go. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Pull, 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 pull. Get now trying to trap an arm. Attack an arm bar. Oh, we're getting to finish here. This might just be a matter of time. And there it is! Wow! Wow! Oh my goodness, what a fight. Yeah, no doubt about it. That is some opportunistic grappling right there. And nice finishing instincts as well. You see a lot of fighters get the dominant position, but aren't necessarily able to lock up the choke or force the tap. No problem with her as she gets one of the bigger wins of her UFC career. All right, let's check out some of the action in that previous round. DC, she certainly kept the stat trackers busy with all those takedowns. All those takedowns and some really nice takedowns. She did a great job of level changing, getting into her opponent, not allowing her opponent to defend before she can secure her takedown. So there she is, your winner by way of submission. A huge result for her here tonight. And you gotta think that'll mute some of the naysayers she had coming in. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, eight seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out due to an arm bar, Valentina Bullet Shevchenko. Well, really nice to see this young woman get a chance to exhale as she celebrates with her coaches. You won world titles in two divisions, but you're not calling your shot the way she is. She said, I'm going to win this fight by submission. And it goes into the books just that way. That's so much confidence to put yourself out on the limb like that. Nobody is brave enough to say, I'm going to do it here, here, or here. She did exactly that and got that submission. Her star will only shine brighter after this performance.